You right? Hey guys. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome to Log Cabin Gaming. We have got Andy and Ross with us and Hello. it looks to be going to be a shootout today. I think we've got our Courage on Overlords and Stormcast Eternals. Yep. And you've got your shooty list. Yeah, pretty much the same that. as last time, because um, I'm new to it, seeing yeah. what's good, what's worth keeping, what's worth slipping out, so I've changed one artefact, but unfortunately it's the same as last time. Okay. So. Yeah, I've just got a similar to last time, um, a few more boats, <laughs> yeah, okay. uh, probably there, four. Four boats, yeah. <laughs> so I don't know how it's going to work, but okay. we'll see. Good. And a big shout out to Mini Magtray as well, um, we've started doing something with them, so um, we're going to be using their their mag trays, and not because we well, it's because we want to, or well, I want to. I mean, I've really been using good. them for years. Yeah, yeah well, not for years. As long as they've been around, I've, yeah. I've really enjoyed my drops. So yeah. <laughs> so um, yeah, big shout out to them. You'll see their logo come in. We're going to put a description in the link if you want to go to their website, and they've very kindly given Log Cabin Gaming um, viewers five percent off. So if you use Log Cabin Five, you get five percent off your order. And the the trays are only a couple of quid each, so uh, you can kind of customize your army you don't have to overbuy which is good uh, there's also a review that I've done which I'll post the, the tag I don't know how YouTube works there'll be a, a thing here <laughs> maybe <laughs> yeah <laughs> somewhere uh, if you guys want to see it in a bit more detail um, but no they're pretty cool and thanks for all the comments about people um, wanting to buy Dyson t-shirts we do actually have a website log cabin gaming.co.uk, go to the web shop and uh, you can buy some stuff and it helps us fund things. So we've got some wireless mics this week, so hopefully we'll get rid of the curse of the uh, uh, the weird audio and hopefully Ross can still, speaking of curses, <laughs> that continue was, that with was one that only, I'm sure. Yeah, get rid of his <laughs> dice curse. My dark questions. <laughs> so we will see. Uh, we're going to set up and uh, for the scenario and uh, we'll see you guys in a bit. Cheers. is 1990 points of anvils that held and hammer again um, our, my general is a lord arcanum on foot uh, she's got the spell starfall which is a more ranged one which i didn't use last time but fits well with the shoot cast and she means that i can have secretaries as battle line which is the main reason she's general um, she's got the artifact uh, soul thief from uh, the storm host that i chose Next up is the Lord Castellant. He's got a, uh, an artifact because I've got a battalion and he's got Lantern of the Tempest, which means that uh, Andy has to reroll sixes to hit within uh, six inches of me. Seems like a good one to try. Uh, Knight, uh, sorry, the Knight Heraldor is next. He has a trumpet. <laughs> yeah, that's all you need to know. Um, the Lord Relictor is next. He's got the extra prayer blessed weapons, which I used incorrectly last time, but should still be good on some sectors this time. And then for battle line, I've got two units of five judicators uh, with bows, and then 20 sectors with uh, Tempest Swords and uh, Storm Spike Great Maces. Then I've got my battalion, uh, which is nine castigators and a ballista and a Lord Ordinator. And basically the Lord Ordinator gives plus one for War Machines um, to hit. If the Castigators uh, wound something in a phase, then I can reroll hit rolls with that one Ballista. Uh, and then in addition to that, I've got a second Ballista and I bought my own Endless Spell again. But I'm a bit scared of it. <laughs> So, I'm running Barrett Zifflin today. Uh, so, reroll ones against flyers, which is going to be completely pointless. Um, I can always run six, and um, once per game in the hero phase, I can get a free move with one, one unit. I remember that. Uh, on the bottom left, the drunkard is the chemist. He, sorry, the navigator. Uh, he's got an uh, artifact where he's got a little sort of flare pistol, and if it hits, everything gets to reroll against that unit for that turn. 
good artifact. Then it's Nendrin Master. He's got the Cogmonculus artifact, <laughs> which once each turn he can reroll a hit, a wound, or a save roll. And then the last one is the Navigate, sorry, the Chemist, getting the right way around. He's got the Forced artifact, the Staff Ocular Optimization, which is a plus one to hit gun thing. The reason I've got three artifacts is because I've got, he's got the Command Trait Collector, which means he can have an artifact and allow somebody else to have another one. And I have a battalion. So behind that is my battalion, which is the Grunstock Escort Wing. So the Thunder is at the front, lots of different guns, two wings model, pretty good. And then got an ironclad and two gun haulers, all with sky cannons. And then what's the battalion? It's uh, in the shooting phase, I can nominate a unit, each shooting phase, nominate an enemy unit, and the battalion can be our ones to hit against it. Uh, and is it these? Not the heroes, uh, just the dudes behind. Uh, two squads, ten Arconauts, standard, one of each weapon. Battle line. Two squads of three engine riggers with grapple launchers. And a frigate, which in Zifflin is also a battle line. Um, and a cannon. He has a cannon. That is 1990. Today's scenario is the Forest of Eyes, which is taken from the new Wrath of the Ever Chosen book. And what it is, it's a simple objective game, but uh, each turn you have three objectives and one of them <laughs> becomes infested with spiders. And what that means is you've got any units within nine inches, you roll 2d6, and if it's equal or greater to their bravery characteristic, that unit suffers d3 mortal wounds. <laughs> uh, it lasts for, for five rounds. And if you control the objective that's infested with spiders, you score three points for that turn. Um, if nobody controls the infested one, then the player who controls most objectives scores two victory points. And if neither player controls the infested objective and both players control an equal number of objectives, you score one point. All right, let's uh, set up. Oh, there we go. All right, okay, so we set up. And this is how it looks. Andy has... <laughs> hidden all his stuff in corners because I think he's wanting to utilise the fly high rule. Um, Ross has got half of his stuff on the battlefield and the rest is up in the pub. In the pub, the sky. <laughs> the big pub in the uh, sky. So I guess we need to roll. <laughs> we need to find out where this spider infested uh, doodah is. Should I go for Objective. it? So, uh, One to that end? Uh, you need to, well, you need, to, huh? to, you need to roll a dice each. Oh, right, sorry. So, uh, Try again. Four. Gets a four. I don't know why I gave you that one back. <laughs> and he gets a four. If you re roll. <laughs> Exciting stuff. Six. Four and a six. Right, Andy, so I can to, choose. Uh, no, well, now you roll. This is the weird bit, but <laughs> you oh. now roll a dice. One, two, three, four. Middle. So spider infested is the middle. I guess it's a way to evenly choose next time. So, can mm -hmm. you finish setting up first? Major Ross, so it's your choice. Uh, I'd like you to take the first turn, please. Oh. Will I drink beer? <laughs> yes. Right, okay. So, nothing to do in a hero phase. <laughs> Get my command point. Kill a frigate. <laughs> you might Ooh. have to do some healing. Yeah, okay. Um, I'm going to some movement. There's going to be lots of flying high in boats. So. Right, so this is movement done. Um, Andy's basically flying, flown high, flown high, or teleported. Um, there and there, and I think we've had a squad um, of these guys just run to try and capture a non-infested uh, objective. Oh, I think that's it. Everything is in. You've got stuff garrisoned in there, don't you? Yeah, there's some Arconauts and an engine rigger in that one. Yeah. And a frigate on the other side. It's got the Thunderers and a Navigator in it. Yeah. And the chemist is down here, hidden away. Okay. I guess we best do some shooting. Let's shoot some stuff. <laughs> Let's see what's left. Yeah. I'm going to start over here. Yeah. You left some juicy characters at the edge there. <laughs> oh dear. Um, we'll the gun haulers can go first. So oh, he... There's no uh, lookout, sir. <laughs> no, there is not. So. The carbines 
which here is rubbish type. Everything at the the horn guy. Right, okay. Little two, two sir. He draws a lot of fire. It's almost worth the points just for how irritating his presence annoying. is. The other guy's probably more important, but I've, that <laughs> horn man, I, just, I don't like him. <laughs> don't like that horn. Uh, so his carbines are threes and fours. Nope. Um, I mean, what I'm going to do, use my uh, battalion. Oh, okay. Um, and nominate a unit to die from the battalion, and I'll do that for the other guy. So rear one's against him for units in the battalion, so it's probably not going to come up much. But um, So just carry on with the gun holder. He has also got a cannon. We'll do the shrapnel shots, it's D6 shots. <laughs> threes and threes. Hey, minus one friend, two damage. Okay, <clears throat> I'm really done. Sorry mate. So I've got a four plus save and uh, five wins. It's a one. <laughs> what a shock. Two I'll wins. wins. Oh, I'll take two, two wins, that's two down. Okay, and that's three. All right, the um, Thunderers in the frigate, they're going to shoot. Okay. They've got a bit of a messy war scroll, that frigate, <laughs> yeah. unfortunately. Who are they shooting at? So they'll shoot the same guy. Okay. So these are rerolling. I <laughs> know oh, they're not rerolling. So the rifle is threes and fours. Double hit. And three wins with the double barreled eighth shot rifle at minus one. Okay, four plus save goes to five plus. One's. Just one damage each. Okay, that takes him out. Oh, okay. He's got five All wins. Right, right. So saves me doing the mess of a war scroll. One. Blood tie! Hey! <laughs> Ross tie. Yeah. All ones count as six <laughs> Yeah. Are they in 12 of the next dude? Probably are, yeah. Alright, so I've still got the frig. I'm not going to shoot the navigator because his artifact is the one where you rerolled everything to hit after right. he's hit hit a target, oh, okay. but it's one use only, and it's a first hit, so if I hit something rubbish, it's gone. So he's not going to shoot. But the engine riggers now are going to shoot at um, Toots McGee. Uh, yeah. Oh no, he's gone, sorry. The, uh, the general. The general. Oh, the general. So first of all, I've got their rapid fire rivet guns. There's two of them, so threes and fours. These are not part of battalions, they're not. Just one. one. <clears throat> At minus one, one damage. All right, three plus save goes to a four plus, which have failed. So they've got six Go. wounds, so get into five. And they've also got a grapple launcher, so one attack, fours and threes. <clears throat> yes. Oh, that's <laughs> three damage, that one. Yeah. Well, I think the frigate's just gonna have to unload on him. Okay. It's just gonna have to unload on him. So. You'll do his D6 shots. Yep. Cannon as well. Three. Mm -hmm. A little better. Threes and threes. He's not part of the battalion. Oh, no. no. And he's got four carbines. Threes and threes. Two. Uh, minus one. Two okay. damage. Three plus save goes to four plus, which I failed both of. Yeah. That's another, another four damage. Four damage. Oh, Ross. So I've got one wound. Have you made a save yet? The <laughs> curse. <laughs> no, that doesn't That's surprise me. Um, everyone's shot on that side, though, apart from the navigator, so I might have to try a long charge and hope. He's, a, he's survived. <laughs> all right, that's the shooting done that side. These guys all ran, so they can't yeah. shoot. Over um, here. So over here. Oh, he, actually, the cannon, the ironclad might end up shooting at him. If it's in range. Let's start with the little dudes at the front. So the small, uh, the engine riggers. So the, uh, the, the balloon guys. The balloon guys. Yeah. They've got a 12 inch That's range. Where they shoot at? Uh, they'll shoot at that, because that's horrible. Uh, the belly star. The Threes and fours. Three at minus one, one damage. Okay, so four plus save goes to five plus. So you have a oh, save oh, two. Oh, save two. And you have a plus two as well. Or something no, that's for cover. That's it from my cover. 
so I say only two, so I take one wound, so yeah, I have uh, seven wounds, so I've got six left. Temporarily. Yeah, at the moment. <laughs> I'm not even finding a six counter, because I know you're going to change um, it so quick. <laughs> and the grapple launcher, one attack, fours and threes. Miss. Okay, that's them done. Didn't <laughs> take long. The, uh, let's carry on with short range. No, it's too right. So the gun hauler at the same dude. If he's within 12, otherwise I'll shoot the other guy. No, he's out of 12. So he shoots cannon at them and his short range guns at the judicators, his carbines. So his cannon. Let's do the other attack this time. Right. So he's one shot, threes and twos. Okay. But he does d6 damage. <laughs> um, no rerolls against him. Okay. Brilliant. And the two shots in the other guy, threes and fours. No. Oh dear. Oh wow, this is not a good <coughs> shooting phase. The curse of Ross is now the <laughs> curse of Andy. It feels like a pretty good shooting phase yeah. on one side. Yeah. Right, let's do the Arkanaut company inside. Very little is going to be in range. They've mostly got nine inch range weapons. Um, so the volley gun's in range. So where are they? Um, They're, in the, They're in the little one. The big one. The big one. So the volley gun and the skyhook are in range. And where are they shooting at? They'll shoot at him, yeah. The ballista again. In fact, they're going to use their one bit of gold. Because <laughs> right. otherwise I'll forget to use it to re-roll hits okay. this turn. This is probably very stupid. They get minus one bravery now as well. So <coughs> fives and fours for this gun. Three hits so it's far. Not too bad. Oh wow! Yeah. Can't moan about that. Fours to wound. Two wounds at minus one one damage. Okay, so so four plus goes to five plus. Yeah, one so more. Least one. So that's down to five wounds now for seven. And then the uh, sky hook. Fours and threes. Gold to hit. Here's the gold. gold. Yes. Three to wound. Yes. <laughs> Minus two. Okay, four plus goes to six. Oh, which I don't make. I normally say good. D3 yeah. damage. D3. Just one. One. Oh, no. I am too close to you, mate. <clears throat> that just leaves the big boy. How many wounds does that? Um, this has got, got four left, so it started oh, on seven, you took three off. Quite a lot. I'm going to split fire because it's more fun. <laughs> okay. So I'm going to put his big cannon. How many wounds has this guy got left? Uh, one. Only one. I'll drop it into him. Who would you like to get a cannon and who would you like to be torpedoed? <laughs> um, I'll cannon him. <laughs> that was fun. Getting, so, General's, General's going to get cannon, the uh, ballista's going to get torpedoes, and the judicators mm -hmm. are going to get carbine. <clears throat> um, we know that's <laughs> yeah. I'm not going to do any rerolls or anything, so, although I have rerolls against this guy because I used my uh, tabby. Yeah. So I'll do him first. A cannon, shrapnel shell, threes and threes. Okay. We're on him <coughs> once. That was a hit. That was a hit. So three at minus one rend, but two damage. Okay. But one wound left. So he goes to four pluses. Oh no! Oh, he does it! Oh, no. <laughs> well done. Survived. <coughs> okay, let's uh, torpedo this other guy then. Fours and threes on the ballista. Yeah. It's a very Warhammer Quest, that figure. Yeah, I like it. Nice. It's a fun conversion. Oh, nice. Quad four. Oh, so so the torpedoes are minus one D3 damage. On the ballista, you say? Yes. Sorry. Yes. Uh, so it's four plus save, goes to five pluses. Save one. Two D3 so, damage. Yep. Yeah. Out of here. Four. Yes. Okay. He's out. I thought you still got your good one over there. Oh, I forgot to shoot the ordinator. 
<laughs> I think you're probably doing quite well, mate. Yeah. Yeah. Very <laughs> so true. Um, yeah. <laughs> Even, yeah. though you, even though you missed with quite a lot, it's still pretty well, uh, slicing Andy, through. Andy, Andy, go first right now. It's a hard one. Have you got a double uh, and you get those loads of charges in? Yeah, you could I do mean, a lot you, of damage. You were, you were behind stuff. I, yeah, I misread it. I thought you were probably going to land on these and then the fight would ensue that Probably was that a wise way. decision. <laughs> but at the same time, I don't think I could have done much for the first turn anyway. I might have been able to pop a couple of blister shots off and that was it, so. <laughs> the carbines were three. Eight shots. Right. <laughs> threes and threes. These are the judicators. Yeah. So three at uh, minus one, but two damage each. Okay. Four plus saves go to five pluses. Four so damage. Two go. So I'll take these two. They've got two wins each. <coughs> Shame. <coughs> To say the least. The problem is, you're probably going to get three points here. So you'll actually be winning at the end of this turn. It doesn't feel like it. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't actually at least I haven't much, moved though. anything, so I'm not that cares. A herald, what was it, a herald or an, um, the ballista is ballista. pretty major, I would say. That was what did most of the work last battle, yeah. I think, even though it wasn't part of the battalion. So I'd say that's uh, quite a setback. Trumpet guy, I'm pretty much just getting now because Ali hates him and now I know you hate him. I just. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm gonna. Let's try some charges. Mm hmm. Because that's the only shooting phase. I forgot he had a charge phase. Um, is the guy at the back in range? I can't see. Can you... um, yeah. I have no idea. Oh, what he's... The, this guy. Is he. I say within no, range. I'd say he's. I think you'd need a 12. So I'll roll it and see. Then. Definitely not a nine. And the uh, engine rig is at the front. Except, no, because they're nine away. Yeah. Or at least nine away. They're nine away from the other guy. Cool. All right. That is. Oh, those engine riggers will try and charge too. Why not? Mm -hmm. I don't know what they need. They'll need quite a big charge. More than seven. Okay. That's the end of my go. So we've got so, battle shock to do here. Yeah. Bravery seven. Lost two. There you go. Pass. There. Okay. A time and a place for ones. Right, so you... no, do Don't it score yet, do I? Yeah, it's a big advantage going second, actually. Yeah, it yeah, feels like a big advantage. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Fine. We're trying to help. Yeah. I'm going to make some strategic choices, and they're going to be just wonderful. <laughs> Play the objectives. Play the objectives. Yes, I'll go for objectives this time. So, first off, I am going to cast Bless Weapons with my Lord Relictor. It's going to cast it on the Castigators. So it goes off on a, um, a 4 plus, which I fail. Yeah. If I'd have done that, basically a 6 inflicts an extra hit, which would have been quite nice. Um, I'm going to cast my Endless Spell with my Lord Arcanum of Quicksilver Swords. I'm going to try. I think it's casting value. Six. Yep. Apologies. Ten. So I manage it. Do you want to unbind it or anything? It's with the Arcanium to start. How many spells? Have uh, you got another spell to do? No, it's just one per turn. Well, I might as well. The navigator is in that boat over there. Let her do something before we kill her. No. <laughs> okay, so I can set it up within ten, e uh, ten inches and then move it eight inches. And it can fly. We can shoot it. <laughs> it's anything that flies. So I'm going to send it this way before I get popped into a puff of smoke. So if I set it up wholly within 10, mm -hmm. and then I can move it up to 8 away. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to go for it there. And then, as its effect, uh, after this model's moved, you can pick one unit within 6 inches of it and roll 12 dice. Each roll of 6 is a mortal wound. So I'm going to choose... But he gives boats, like a six up, death save sort of thing. Oh right, okay. Save, just not that it makes much difference, but... I will go for this mini one, I reckon. Mm -hmm. It's not going to be game changing. Cute. Right, any sixes will be a mortal wound. One, two, three. Three. Three more wounds? Yeah. Cool. 
Usually at this point, I'd use a command point to activate a unit. But I think it's so like odds and sods that I'm not going to, because the ballista's not within 18 inches of anyone. The cascaders have got numbers on their side. These guys are diminished. So that's the end of my hero phase. That's what I'm going to do. So it's going to movement. Yep. So I'll bring a load of people down, I reckon. I dropped some units, so uh, on objectives, learning from last time. Uh, so we've got 20 sequiturs here, but the Lord Castanet is with them as well. Uh, in the middle, we dropped only five judicators. But they're right on that spine. They the are, yeah. yeah. The um, relictors run off towards them, uh, see if I can get any buffs or spells off next turn. The These lot are basically just turned to consolidate. They're who knows how that's going to go, really. That wasn't... I thought they'd be quite a good turtle unit, but they've, they've obviously taken some losses. So they are just going to try and focus. The castigators can move forward a bit, but not all of them can shoot this direction. But what they can shoot means they can get some rerolls with the ballista. Uh, and then the Arcanium just scurried into him. That's possibly the last thing that she's going to do. <laughs> yeah. Running away from her own swords. So, yeah, yeah, how we get going at least. So, yeah, that's my movement phase. I'm going to do some shooting now, I reckon. Right, where are we going? Cool. I'm going to start off with the judicators, and I'm going to shoot at these guys. Are they Endrin Riggers? Is that right? So, if I grab some dice. Sorry. Judicators are... A three plus to hit, the red dice is the prime, and it's a two plus to hit with the explodey bolt. Excellent. So this turns into d6 hits. One. <laughs> so two hits, and they are a three plus to wound. Minus one rend. Got a four up, so a five up save. Nope. And how much damage? Uh, just one, sorry. So they got two wins each. Or? They do. There's one down. Next up, the castigators are going to fire at them. They've got an 18 inch range, though, so I think realistically. I don't know if you think that one's in range as well. Yeah, he is with yeah, this one. Range, yeah. yeah, you're happy with um, yeah. two, four, six firing? Okay. Yeah. Make sure you agree. Uh, so you've got one attack each, threes and threes. That's bang on the average. <laughs> okay, so that's three saves with a minus one rend. Why off again? No. Three more wounds? Yep. Just one and what I should have done is empowered their um, accuracy so I could reroll ones, but as usual, I forgot. So I'm not <laughs> used to playing with the Soul Wars ones. I forgot that with the Sequitors last time as well, empowering their shields and saves, so I'm talking about it now. In 10 <laughs> seconds, I'm also gonna to forget to do that with the sequences, but <laughs> I'm just happy to be here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so now the castigators have hit them. The ballista could get re-rolls against that unit, but to be honest, I don't think I wanna fire at that now. I'm gonna fire at the large boat with the ballista. Ironclad. I only get one shot because I'm over 18 inches away. So it's a four plus to hit because of the Lord or No, it's not because it's the long range one. So it's a three plus to hit, which goes to a two plus because of the Lord Ordinator giving it a plus one. So it hits, it turns into D6 hits. Six. Mm. That's excellent. And these are threes and threes to wound. Very nice. Ooh. Excellent. And that is a minus two rend, one damage. All right. So here's three up save normally. So it's five up. Saves two, takes three. Just one wound each? Yes. It's three damage. Oh, uh, and sorry, the gun holder is next to it, so he has a six plus ward. So right, I okay. To make the wound go away. No, takes three. Excellent. Uh, next, I'm going to fire with these judicators at these guys. Double check the range, but they're totally within. So I've got four normal shots at a three plus, and the blue one is the prime at a two plus to hit. 
Does the blue one with the prime? Yeah. yeah. So that one hits, turns into d6 hits, which is a one. <laughs> That's a nice group of sixes. Yeah. Three plus to wound. Three wounds, minus one rend, one damage. All right, who was this on? The These guys. You got four up save. So it goes to a five up. Take two wounds. Uh, the only other thing I'm going to do is go for a charge with my Sequitors. You don't need any Ross Kerr's dice rolls here. Yeah, a nine. At least a nine. Fingers. A nine! nine. <laughs> Just Excellent. make it. So the front row of these guys should all be nine away from this one. Cool. Okay, I'll start off. I think it's the start of the combat phase when they have to drop their bombs. Yeah, oh, okay. Yep, yep. Not the not his good one that he had his artifact for. But the ironclad drops his bomb racks. Uh, so it's a, he's unwounded. It's two plus. So take D three more wounds. Yep. Just, just one. Yep. And the I think his ones are saying. And a four up, he doesn't, he's just a four up for the gun hauler. Yep. Yep. He takes three. Okay, three. four more to wounds, that's pretty good. Two people go. Okay. Mm hmm. Right, combat. I will start fighting against this if I may. So with the swords have three attacks each, and then the great maces have two attacks each. So for swords, we've got one, two, three, four. Threes and fours. And again, I should have empowered them. Oh yeah, what's your empower? I'm channeling their, my memory, uh, channeling their weapons so I can re-roll failed hit rolls. It's threes, wasn't it? Yeah. So I can re-roll one, two, three, Four, five, three plus to hit. Nice. That's bad, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, it's a four plus to wind. Oh, I can't even hold them. And then, what's the rend? Where are they? There's no rend on those. It's one damage. Okay, so you've got four up save. You know, what I'm going to do is, because he's probably going to die, use his one bit of gold to use the reroll saves to try out. Cool. Four up save. Takes one. Oh dear. One so far. How many wounds does he have? Ten. Gosh. Right, okay. So I've got two of these <laughs> mauls in combat. They've got two attacks each. Uh, so these are three pluses to hit. I can re-roll failed yeah. ones because I empowered their weapons. So three plus to hit, so they all hit. Uh, three plus to wound. Two wounds. They've got a minus one rend but do two damage. Five up, re-roll in. No, failed them both. Two damage each, four. Yeah, two damage already taken the ones, so it's five so far. Yeah. Okay, and then my last one is one of those maces again. Against the flying guy. The last yeah, guy. this one on there. He's got two attacks. Three plus to hit. Uh, three plus to wound. One wound. Minus one rend. Two damage. Saved. Oh, come on. Cool. Your turn. Uh, I'll just do that little dude. Then he's terrible. <laughs> he's got a gun butt. Which is one attack. Fours and fives. Is yep. that... <laughs> Do we say we got minus one to hit? Still, because they landed this oh, turn. Yeah. Or oh, I do. It? Yeah, I guess so. Okay, it would have been fives and fives. Just as <laughs> the only time I'll remember it as well. So, yeah, yeah, time shock and awe. <laughs> <laughs> just Everyone's in shock. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> me going, too. I guess because you're not going to do anything else, are you? No, that's it. All right, so the gun hauler. He has four attacks. Normally fours and fours, and that's fives and fours. They all miss. The uh, Arkanaut Company. Quite a lot of attacks, but not going to do anything. So I've got three, no, two gun butts, but it'll be fives and fives. 
No. I've got the only close combat weapon, which is a sky pike. Two attacks, fours and fours, so fives and fours now. Ah, one hit. One wound. That is minus one D3 damage. Oh dear. Four plus stick. save goes to five plus. To fail. Ooh, D3. One. one wound. Cool, that doesn't take Three. anyone off. Yeah, one of the best. Six. And then I've got six, the other six, sorry, the other seven members of that squad. Um, who have just got fours and fours, so fives and fours. That's a good roll. Uh, Force to wound. Nice. That's another good roll. Three wounds from the uh, company inside the ironclad. Are they mortals? No, no, no. Oh, sorry, sorry. sorry. Sorry, four plus save. Is there rend? No. Oh, you saved them all. Look at got it. Sorry, I misheard. I thought they were, you said they're mortals. No, no. I do the guy who's got the best attacks, that character in there. So three attacks, normally threes and threes, so it's going to be fours and threes. But any uh, unmodified six, there's, there's three mortal wounds to hit. So now it's three mortal wounds. Fours and threes, hoping for some sixes. No. That is minus one D3 damage. Okay, four plus goes to five plus. To fail. It has two mortal wounds. Okay, we'll take. Might it's actually out. have battle. Oh no, you just two, three. And then the last thing is the ironclad. He's got eight brawny weapons. Jar fours and fours, so fives and fours. Two hits. One wound, no rend. Four plus. Oh, come on. <laughs> the other one. Is that four die? Yep. Four down, all entangled. Okay. Is that the end of combat? I think so. Cool, that is the end of my first turn. Alright, so we've got some battle shots to do. Yes. So these guys have got a bravery of seven. Ooh. Yeah, it's terrible. Yeah, bravery seven, they lost four. Six, so fine. So pass. Plus one for being more than ten. Yes. So uh, that's it for me. The engine, I'll do the engine riggers there. So they're bravery seven. Six, seven, eight. Yeah, so the last one runs away. And then here, their bravery is about six, I think. Bravery six, and two have died. Okay. That's the end of yeah, so that okay. round. Who's got the objective? I think we all know. <laughs> Ross scores three. So Ross scores three at the end of battle round one. Hey, you just call it now. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. I'll give you an easy time. There's a lot of, lot of stormcast on this board. Right, so we need to do a bit of rolling. What, for the spiders? Yes, well, we need to yep. roll to see who rolls for the spiders. <laughs> so oh, do I, don't I take damage for them? For the uh, judicators no, in the middle? No, because it would be at the start of the battle. Though. Oh, fine, okay. So, so okay. rolling to see who rolls to see where the spiders are. Well, it's a one. So, and again, so, so... I don't know what I'm rolling for. One, two, three, four, five, six. Is the oh, so they never got hit by the spiders? They never did, no. Right, so it's moving. Now, yeah. Four. Four, they ah, will do. So they, they will move. now. Yeah. There's D3 mortals, is it? Uh, so you roll 2d6, <laughs> and if it equals their bravery, they take D3 mortal wounds. Oh, their bravery is always seven. terrible. Seven. Come on. Oh, oh they're no, fine. No. they just squashing them. Yeah. yeah. Right, so now we need to roll to see who goes first. Okay. Right. Uh, it's a six. It's a game ending roll, I think, <laughs> isn't it? Yeah. Isn't it? I don't know. How am I going to get that off you? You could let me have another go. <laughs> I'll probably screw up on my own. I, mean, I could do. I <laughs> could do. <laughs> so the engine master is going to try and heal the boat a bit. It heals, a bo <laughs> the boats heal one naturally anyway. Right. And the, he heals D3 a turn. So he's going to heal. 
two. Uh, he's only taken three, so he's back to full health. That one can't be healed. And that one's... No. The engine riggers can heal boats, but I think it has to be within an inch. Yeah, it has to be within an inch, so they can't. Okay. Um, the navigator might as well try and unbind the... Unbind? That's the right word, isn't it? Mm -hmm. The end of spell. It's either six, six wasn't it? So it needs a seven six. to get rid of it. No. Oh, wait, you should have moved that. Sorry. We we jumped ahead because I took the, the, took the turn. Oh, is it my turn You to should move have moved it. the... Oh, apologies, um, apologies. Sorry. Let's put it in your way. So you can move up to eight inches. No, they can all fly anyway. It's just... But you can so obviously get them to hit. Put it there hit. and target these these guys. The end riggers. Yeah. Yep. Unless that's done. Why don't I target that boat? I've actually started to do some damage on it. All right. Twelve dice. Need to consolidate. Think about just one thing at a time. Mm -hmm. Right. Any sixes is a mortal wounds. Oops. Do that. You got that one again? I think that was a six. It was a six. So yeah, that's right. again if you want. It's outside the tray. Three mortal wounds. Three again. Oh, you got some angry that's swords. That's pretty good, actually. So he's, he's already taken three, so he's taken six now. The little boats don't have a degrading profile. No. So all of that stuff can still fly away. Ah. I don't know if... Well, they will do. Right. Anything else? That is... Uh, I keep can use... <coughs> He's got a thing that gives reroll ones to wound. I might as well just use that. Okay. Although they'll probably run anyway. Or we'll use it on himself. Is it an aura? Is that? We'll use it on himself because they're going to have to run to get that okay. objective. So he's got rerolls to wounds. ones to wound. Okay. So nothing, nothing groundbreaking. Cool. Movement. Uh, movement. If I can find a. <coughs> so this is how we moved. Um, there's a mass exodus. From here to over here, these guys didn't run, did they? No, I couldn't quite get to the objective, so uh, they didn't run, so they can now shoot instead. And then these guys shot the over here. Uh, right, so the battalion to nominate someone to try and smash up and they'll nominate the ballista over there. Good choice. So the thunderers and the gun hauler, the only two over there that got, are get that benefit. Um, I'll start over here. So these guys, because they're not going to be in range of anyone else to shoot at. Their pistols are only nine, so none of them are in range. <laughs> the volley gun is a 12, which is that one. That's not in range. I did this well. <laughs> and Skyhook's 18 inch range. That's in range. Right. So only one, one shot. Uh, fours and threes, I think, yeah. Missed. <laughs> 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 and uh, he's been running once to yeah. wound, but he's out of range to shoot. That was clever as well. <laughs> what an idiot. <laughs> All right, the gun hauler. And he's only got one shot that's uh, going to hit. So let's do the shrapnel this time. Okay. D6 hit. Shots. Three. Threes and threes. Nice. Nice. So two, a minus one, two damage. Sorry, into these, assuming. Yep. Uh, so four plus save goes to five plus. Oh my god. Oh, Ross. <laughs> well done. They're keeping this objective. They want it, don't they? For a few seconds. <laughs> uh, we'll do. <clears throat> oh, not still there. Let's go out this side instead. Okay. So I've got the uh, engine riggers. We can shoot the blister. Yep. Threes and fours and threes. Wow, one hit. Oh, I think it might be threes and fours. Go on, be threes and fours. It is threes and fours. Three hits. No oh, wounds. No. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> um, let's shoot the gun hauler into him as well. So he's rerolling ones. Uh, so the carbines, just threes and fours. 
three early uh, ones. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> one wound, at minus one, one damage. Okay. Four plus save. Is that on the ballista, sorry? Yes. <laughs> yeah, four plus save, sorry. And then these, uh, he'll do the shrapnel cannon too, D6 shots. Four shots, threes and threes. Three already ones. <laughs> And three to wound. Oh, there. Hello. Minus one, two damage. Okay. Ooh. Four plus save goes to a five plus. I make Ooh. two. So it takes two. So it takes uh, it two lots of two wounds. Yeah, so seven wounds goes down to three. The Thunderers inside the. Oh, I didn't do the other guy's attack on the engine rigger. Sorry, I missed one of the shots. The fours and three. One shot, the fours and threes. He hit, and he wounded. Minus two, three damage. <laughs> you <just laughs> got that one. That was, him, that was his best attack. That's gone. Yeah, um, so it would have changed in order. That was his, one of his best attacks. Uh, yeah. <laughs> He's got a really good gun at the back. <laughs> Only one shot. Right. Um, the frigate is 12 inch range. Can you, just, is it in range of, I guess, the ordinator, I guess? No, it's nothing, mate. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes. <coughs> yeah. 12 inch range is all round. Although he's not buffing anything now, is he? Think about it. Uh, no. He's going to shoot his cannon at stuff. Okay. Shoot his cannon at the ordinator and his other gun at the. Um, Arcanum. Arcanum, thank you. Is there a lookout server at the moment? They've both got lookout server, mm -hmm. yeah. Because yeah, I don't know happy. what I was. I'm pretty sure she's I may gone, have... really, one wound. Uh, so, normally threes, and then fours to hit, but I'm re rolling, but I can't re roll the th um, threes, can I? Because the modifiers before re rolls before modifiers. Ah, uh, yeah. I can re roll the two, which misses anyway. Mm. There, she might survive. Threes to wound. One. My only minus one. Three plus save goes to four plus. <gasps> she is alive. Yeah. Uh, shoot his carbines into them. Yep. And screw it, torpedoes too. Let's put a cannon on his head. <laughs> that sounds fun. Yep. Uh, so, professional. The torpedoes first. Threes and threes. These are on the guys at the front. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so two wounds, minus one. But two damage. Oh, wow. Okay, okay. four plus save. Oh, sorry, they've got a four plus save normally, so you said minus one, yeah. No, so, so one, take two damage. Yeah, one dies. And then his other one is fours and threes. Oh, <laughs> Ross, what are you doing to me? Minus one, D3 damage. Okay, so it goes to five, let's save again. D3 damage. One. One wound. They've got two each. So. And then they have a shrapnel cannon, six shots, threes and threes into. He got a really good armor save. The re relictor? Yeah. Yeah, I won't go near him. <laughs> uh, no, you were going to rinse all of them. Uh, three plus save, five wins. So yeah, pretty, pretty good, good actually. Pretty good. Uh, threes and threes. Oh dear. Maximum of four damage I'm going to do. Minus one. Okay, three plus goes to four plus saves, which oh, I make. Nice. Wow, this is... This is the prosecutors all over again, the flying guys, isn't it? Yeah. What if I killed this entire shooting phase? It feels bad a still, mate. I would, I'm yeah. worried. Yeah. <laughs> it feels bad. Yeah, but that's... But to be honest, next time I'm doing an objective game, I might drop the ballistas on the points, because I've got seven wounds. Yeah, I think... Because <clears> at the end of this move, game, I don't yeah. have to edge around three inches every time. Do I? You're going to score three, another three, you'll be six new up going to turn three. And well, if it goes on to that one, <laughs> you're going to win. It's, it's utter wisdom. It's up not, to the, uh, not just random. <laughs> um, okay. Moving right. stuff around at all. That's any, all my shooting. Any charges? 
Nah. Yeah, you know, the, he's got the, that gun over there's got the artifact that um, does more to wounds when he charges. He's got a torpedo, a one use torpedo. <laughs> She's going to turn and face. So he's, uh, Before it he'll try the charge. Seven. Well, that looks like it's going to be quite close. Yeah. Cool. Oh, sorry, I think. See, within seven and a half. All right, that touches the base. Is it the little yeah. one? Is it this one? Yeah. Yeah, I reckon that, that goes up to a... Okay. Yeah, do you agree? I'll take your word for it. I can't see from over here. Um, so when he charges on the two plus, he's one use artifact. Two plus, he does D6 and auto wounds. So she's gone. gone. Yeah. Five mortal wounds. Oh dear. And that's his torpedo gone. Um, although he's charged, so he could pile and stay his dudes, can't he? Yeah. He's rubbish in combat, but. So, uh, the so injury is. I probably can't get in, but I'll roll it, and it's a double. S no, definitely, not, definitely not with a four. Um, I'm grateful for that because they're quite messy in combat, aren't they? Mm. Worth the salt. Oh, you know what? They're going to try and charge. Because oh. if they survive enough, they might take that objective. Mm -hmm. I don't know what they need. That's not a <laughs> well, no. uh, I got two command points, yeah. couldn't I? So I'm going to use one of them to reroll that for that chemist. Yeah. Eight. Eight. That will get them in, I think. Thank you. Or will it? No, 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 no way no, near. No. No. Nowhere near. Oh, I shouldn't have rerolled that. It's miles. <laughs> <laughs> cool. All right. Um, combat phase. We've got a bit of combat here. I guess I might as well pile in. I mean, he, he is really terrible. I just did that to kill that dude off. Yeah. So, yeah, so his bombs didn't work because no one was at, <laughs> within an inch at the start of the combat phase. But he's piled in now. Fours and fours with his boarding weapons. <laughs> One hit. One wound. One wound. No, four plus save. Is there a rend in there? No rend, no. That's why I got a one. <laughs> and you get to tap back. Oh, I put it on that one. Uh, yeah, so I can pile in now, can't I? Yeah. Three inches. They yeah, have got... Four, isn't it? How many have you got? I, I think it's three. The fourth one um, didn't quite make it without being over-enthusiastic. So no, well, he's got an inch range. He doesn't have to be Oh, nice. Base, yeah, so. okay. Thank you. Thank you all. Uh, so they've got two attacks each, fours and fours, with the stock of their guns. Wow. Good roll. <laughs> and it has uh, no rend, one four. damage. Four up save. Takes another two wounds. Oh, so he's down to two, is he? He's taken eight, he's got two left. Mm. And that is the end of my go. So we've got a bit of battle shock. Take, we? We'll do it for the judicators. They got bravery of seven. They lost That's one. Fine. That's fine. I hate rolling battle shock yeah. for Stormcast. <laughs> it's so harsh. So cool. Your turn, Mark. Stormcast turn two. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I have to have a think about where I'm going to go. What are we going to do? What are we doing? Hero phase. Well, Andy blew up all my heroes. <laughs> so this has been a disappointing, limited choices kind of phase. The first thing I'm going to do with my Lord Castellan is cast his um, Warden Lantern over these guys. Okay. We've measured it. They have to be wholly within 18 inches, and they are 18 inches is here. So that will give them plus one to save. And on any sixes, are actually heal wounds, which would be great when no one does anything near them at all this turn. The next thing I'm going to do is use one of my command points. So I've got three, so I'm going to go down to two. And I'm going to use uh, the Lord Relictor is going to get these guys to fire at this bait. We had the discussion that Castigators could uh, do it, but then from last battle they were so ineffective, I don't trust them. So I'm going to go for the Judicators <laughs> doing a round of firing into here. Okay. So three normal rolls are three pluses to hit. The red one is the prime, which has a two plus to hit. And it naturally oh, miss. misses. Uh, three plus to wound. That's terrible. It's survive. Minus one rend. Not that. Takes it. So it's so got one wound. Yes. You got one. Oh, it's pathetic there. It doesn't matter. It was meant to free up the castigator so they could peg it. That's a real pain. You've got another command point, don't you? Can't you get another unit to shoot? Nope, because I haven't got any more heroes. 
Or can he cast it twice? Can the yeah. same hero activate it as just the same unit? We just had a chat about the rules and worked out that because both of these units are within nine inches of him, I can use another command point to get these guys to fire yeah. as well, which is really disappointing, but Needs must. lovely that the guys helped me out. So the castigators are going to fire into here. So they have got one attack each, three and threes and threes. So how many is that? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And the green dice is the prime, so you get plus one to hit, I believe. Yeah, the green dice, plus one to hit, so threes. These ones hit anyway, so I shouldn't be greedy. These are to wounds, so it's minus one rend. <laughs> Five up, save. I've got to make all of them. Good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he definitely did. Cool. Oh, yeah, there's 80 gold still. That's a reroll of my wins. I see. Never mind. Awesome. That was a lot of work to just free them up, but I think that was probably the only real thing I could have done this hero phase. Uh, you've got some prayers to do. <coughs> you are correct again. I'm gonna um, I'm gonna cast the healing storm, the healing storm on these guys. Yep. See if I can heal one of these wounds up. Um, in three plus, I can heal D three wounds. It's <laughs> there we go. Sorry, forgetful as always. That is everything that I no, can he's do. Got, he's got two credits. He's I can't cast the same one. No, you've got healing one, and then you've got one that you pick from your law. Bless, I could bless the weapons, bless weapons of, of these guys and the four plus. There you go. There you go. Well done. Yeah. Thank you guys. There's too much going on for me to get what's happening. Yeah, fine. Hero face done. Right. With a little help from my friends. <laughs> yeah, we have a everything there to remember, remind me. Uh, I'll see what I can do in the movement phase now. Okay. I've moved a bit. Um, <laughs> on to objectives. The secretaries have run, just to go all around this. Castellan got a really good role uh, to run over to there, so now there's more people involved here around for him to empower, uh, although these guys got the buff this turn. Um, Castigators ran, so they can't fire, but they're around here. The Relictor ran over to there. These guys move five inches, doing the old choo -choo -choo. <laughs> So these guys can fire, and the other Judicators can fire this round, but that's it really. Okay. So if I start off with these, yep. I'm gonna fire them. Harsh, okay, both both lots are gonna fire at these actually. Okay. They're just within range. Okay. So with these, I've got, uh, the green dice is the prime, so I've got three ups to hit, two up. For the prime. Oh. <laughs> but this one explodes into D6 hits, so he's gonna to totally be fine now. Yeah. Three plus to wound. Door, oh, not too bad. Any rend? Yeah, three plus to wound, minus one rend. Five up, save. Save two. Save two. Oh, wow. One wound. Um. And then the other group are going to do it. So we've lost one. So we've got three normal guys. And the green one is the prime. So three ups, two with that one. That's a pain. Oh, dear. Three up to wound. Oh, well, no. it's back. Oh, My oh, dice no. curse. <laughs> there we go. Um, that's all I've got to do this turn. Right, so... No uh, charges. No battle shot. <laughs> oh, there is a battle shot. Oh, I've got a battle shot, shot now. Yeah. yeah, it was meant to be more of a devastating <laughs> battle shot there. Uh, <laughs> it's meant to be honest. a <laughs> six, one run away. Uh, nope. nope. It's a okay. four. Yep, so Ross has um, secured the spider-infested objective here for another three points. Taking cool. Ross up to six points at the end of turn two. And I survived two turns. <laughs> right, so Minor objective for me yeah. versus you two guys. So we need to roll for who gets the spider priority. It's a bit of a redundant roll, but spider priority. Yeah. Right. Two. Roll the two. Five. five. <laughs> won it every time. I haven't won any of them. One, two, three, four. Please be a five or a six. No. Oh, it's back in the middle. Oh. Spider infested. Okay, so, just the two then. So, yes. Judicators have a bravery of seven. No. Nope. 
Castigators have a bravery of seven. No. Uh, and then and the Relictor has a bravery of nine. No. No. Um, is there, no, that's too far, isn't it? Yeah, it'd be too far. That is a... Uh, Survive the spiders. Nobody cares too much about the spiders. So, right, uh, So turn. roll off for whose turn it is. Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh, I will win draws, because yeah. you had last turn. Okay. Two. <laughs> Six. <laughs> um, you cannot win that game. <laughs> It's not again, I've not managed it. <laughs> I'll undo it myself somehow this turn. Um, I'm going to take the turn just to get some fire in before something bad happens. <laughs> Firstly, I think Andy needs to move some swords. Up to eight. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right, um, my Lord Castellan is going to cast his Warden Lantern over the castigators who are wholly within 18 inches of him. So what does that mean? They get plus one to save. Plus one to save. Uh, and if they roll a natural six, they actually heal a wound. Um, with my Lord Relictor, I'm going to cast Bless Weapons on the Judicators, which goes off on a four plus. Three. I believe, so let me just check it. Yeah, four plus. So if I roll a six to hit, it inflicts one extra hit. He's also going to do the healing storm on these guys. It's a three plus and I can heal D3 wounds if it goes off. Well, it will automatically heal just one anyway, so I'll just take the wound counter away. It might be an all important wound. Um, so their weapons were blessed, weren't they? Uh, then I'm going to use the soul command point that I've got to fire with these guys at those guys there. Three plus to hit. So this one explodes into d6 hits, which is an extra one, three plus to wound, two, with a minus one rend. These aren't very devastating rends, are that. they? Two? Cool. Two, and one out of a uh, take. Oh, I'm good. And that is everything that I can do in my hero phase this time. A lot more concise than last <laughs> round, I forgot everything. Over and over again. They didn't see so, it, Ross. They don't know. Now I'm going to move. Right, so, yeah, Ross has just basically reshuffled these guys and put the castigators at the front. Yep, castigators um, with a plus one save and judicators yeah. came back. Uh, these guys move five again, so they can still shoot, but they're sidestepping towards <laughs> yeah. the other guys. Um, these, these guys didn't yeah, move at all. Stay fast. Yeah, yeah, so I've got some shooting to do again. Um, I'm going to shoot with the castigators into this unit. I'm going to try and force some battle shocks that will hopefully knock you off the objective. So castigators, I've got nine still. Yeah, who are within range. So they're going to um, improve their accuracy, which means I can reroll ones, threes and threes. Good. Yeah. And then threes to wound. Nice. Okay, it's got a minus one rend, one damage. Five up save. Four more wounds. Oh, no. oh dear. That leaves one. Who shall I leave? I guess I should leave the closest one, shouldn't I? <laughs> yeah. If he survives Battle Shock. Which he won't because they're bravery six. <laughs> <laughs> Um, these guys are going to fire at them, hoping for a good round and to do something sorry, they, annoying. Sorry, they're shooting at the end of the Yeah, sorry, across here, hoping to get a decent round and uh, force a battle shock. So we'll see. Yeah. So there's uh, three pluses, green one is a two plus to hit, which is why yeah. I rolled a one. Three plus to wind. Yeah, so minus one rend. One damage? Yes. The same with these guys actually fire at them because that last round was rubbish. I don't, I'm not going to suddenly take down a frigate or anything. And the, actually the one that I've done damage to, it doesn't really feel like it's within line of sight very easily. So yeah, I'm going to fire with these guys. So it's four firing back onto these. Onto the engine riggers yeah. again. Again, the green one's the prime. Three pluses. The prime Oy. hits, which goes into D6 hits. 
and three plus is two wounds. Oh dear. The dice curse creeping back in. Takes one more wound. That guy dies. Yeah. Do you, do you lay him down with one single? No. Cool. Chuck a battle shot in there. Well, I, I did say I wanted to force battle shot. I kind of more forced than <laughs> just <laughs> one, but that's fine. Um, I can't fire with anyone else. That's it. That's all I can do. Okay. So it's just a battle shot there. They're fine. So bravery seven. I just lost one. Yep. These guys, I don't think they can pass. <laughs> They're bravery five actually, because the gold. Oh yeah. Uh, and they've lost six. So, so he's definitely yeah. running away. Do you have any hero stuff to do? I'm going to do the hero phase move. Right. From okay. a frigate, and then get people out. Yeah. Uh, that is my only. He might as well augment himself again, the chemist down here. And that's it, I've got loads of command points, so I'm going to spend, spend, spend. Uh, so my only hero phase really thing is to move this guy 12 inches forward. I'm just going to get him to... Never mind, thank you very much. Because he's moved in the hero phase, I can still get my guys out in the movement phase. Cool. They're going to get assaulted in the middle there, aren't they? Uh, hero phase over, nice, short and sweet. So here we are, the movement phase. Talk us through it. So everyone's out of the boats now. Um, Thunderers and the navigators up here. Yep. And the engine riggers and the uh, Argent Company came out and then the boat moved afterwards. Right, okay. So we're into the shooting phase. Yeah, it looks very menacing from up here. This is, they, that needs to disappear into smoke, all of that. Well, I yeah. We've just said, I've just remembered I didn't move him last turn and he's got within 12 inches, he forces you to reroll sixes on hits of missile weapons. So that's really spectacularly stupid. That could have been a game changer. Right. So the Arcanor, uh, my battalion, I'm going to nominate the... Castigators? Uh, no, the... Judicators. Judicators. <laughs> Thank you. And then the first thing that's going to shoot is the f navigator who's got the flare gun. Right. He's gonna shoot at the other ones. Castigators. <laughs> Thank you. He's got two attacks hitting on threes. If either of these hit, everyone can reroll to hit against them this turn. Okay. Everyone. Everyone. In fact, and he's gonna use his gold. I oh, know he's not gonna use his gold, because I need that later. <laughs> he's gonna use a command point to reroll ones to hit. So I've got three of the flipping things. Three of the things. <laughs> So three used to hit, re-rolling ones. This is two, two, something. Oh, uh -uh. Re-rolling ones. So I got one hit, which is the important thing. It wins yeah. on threes. Minus one, one damage on your castigators. castigators. So it's three plus save. Uh, it goes down, but then goes up again because of the warding lantern. So it's the three plus save. Which I failed. Uh -huh. It's a shock. Did you say one damage? Yeah. Fine. I've got that one. Now does everything have re-roll hits? Everyone has to re-roll, gets to re-roll hits against them now. Yeah. Plus these guys also re-roll ones against the um, other ones, if they choose to. Right. Uh, so I think we'll just go round clockwise, just to make it easier <laughs> in my head. Yeah. So the Thunderers, which are the guys with all the special weapons, are going to shoot the Castigators. So the first shot is the rifles. I've <laughs> there's another rule I've never used because I've never got them out of the boats before. Right. I'd want to hit rolls if they've got all the different special weapons, yeah. if it, uh, as long as they're not in a garrison. So yeah. they're all getting plus one to hit okay. and re rolls to hit. Right. Okay. <laughs> okay. Right. So the double shot rifle the boss has got threes. Correction. Twos. They all hit. Wow. Fours to in. Only one wound. One wound from the rifle, which is one and minus one. Okay, so one wound at minus one. Okay, so then negate that because of the awarded land. So <laughs> four plus to save. Oh, no. You see it skidded and then still yeah. didn't do it. So I lose one there. The fumigator is in range. We've got a nine inch range with so three attacks. This is hitting on threes. Rerolling. 
and wounding on threes. Two hits with the fumigator, so minus one, one damage again. Okay, I'm still at four plus to save. Fail one. And then the last three guns are the ones that all get plus one to hit. So the deck sweeper, four attacks, fours and fours, so now threes and fours. And re rolling. <laughs> One at minus one, one damage again. Okay, four plus to save, so the Castellan's Lantern. I'm hoping for some sixes yeah. because I heal a wound oh, if I do nice. that. Oh, uh, the very nice. The rule is, just to make sure I'm not uh, screwing it up, uh, Warden Lantern, uh, and two next hero phase, each time you make a save roll, seven plus for an attack that targets a unit, you can heal one wound allocated to a model from that unit. Seven so because plus. I get a plus one, oh, right, okay. yeah, add one to save rolls. Yep. So I can take that wound off. Okay. Uh, so I've got the cannon, now hitting on threes, and the wounds on twos, minus two d3 damage. Oh dear. So, and it would heal the wounds, but there isn't one. And then the mortar hitting on threes again, <laughs> and wounding on threes, My, uh, no rend but d3 damage. Okay, so that is a three plus to make. Not good. <laughs> Not good. Okay. Let's let's frigate him. So the frigate, he'll do his. He'll just keep shooting at them. <laughs> D six shots it's from fair. his cannon. Six. six out. So threes and threes, but we are on to hit. Oh, the awesome flare gun. Nice. So four at minus one, but two damage. Okay. So the save is still four plus. So I you take fail two. Save. Yeah. One. Save. How does that work? Save one. Yeah. Save. I heal one of those. So, so I you take, just take three. Four, yeah. Okay. Basically. I take that one and put a wound on. I think that's how it works. <laughs> this one. Yeah, it's odd, isn't it? Saying if you get a seven plus on a dice, but. Uh, and then carbines are threes and threes. Nice. Uh, minus one, two damage. Wow. Could have done all them together, actually. Okay. Four pluses out. Yeah, Is that cool. six? Six damage. Yeah. So oh, that's good. One. Let's go take three. So run my hands. Yeah. Three. <laughs> can put the wind on this guy. They'll probably screw up the battle shock as well, won't they? Well, if there's any left. Um, so the next guy's wrong. <laughs> the engine riggers. Threes and fours with their. Oh, I'll shoot the same guys again. Re rolling because of the flare. Isn't there only two of them? Though? Yeah, the guys. The, this is just the pistol one. Oh, right, okay. They've got three shot pistol. Uh, so two wounds from him, which is minus one, one damage. And then the other guy. Okay, do four offers. pluses. I take one, but the save that I make okay. heals the wound. And then the grapnel launches fours and threes. Reroll. Oh, missed again. Yeah. Okie dokie. Um, I think we'll just keep going round until they're dead. <laughs> <laughs> so, the. Um, what's his chops? So, you've got D6. Balloon ship. Big, <laughs> big balloon man. Ship. So D6, sky cannon shots, three, threes and threes. Why is there four down to <laughs> Threes and threes. threes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. I can re-roll luckily. Oh. And threes to wounds. No. Oh, no. <laughs> oh dear. Um, carbines are threes and fours he's got. He's done oh. nothing. He's out of range. These ones. <laughs> <laughs> okay. We will get them. What are they? They are Arcanauts. They are bog standard Arcanaut company. Right. So we'll do the same thing again. So the volley gun, six shots, yeah. fives and fours. Wow. 
Well, we're we're <laughs> Two hits. One wound at minus one, one damage. Okay. So there's four plus save. So it's minus one and then plus yeah. one from the caster then. The uh, skyhook is one attack, fours and threes. Nope. That was the big one, wasn't it? That's, That's it's D3 damage, damage. It's pretty good. Mm. Um, and then I've got the other So dudes. So one, two, three, four, five. Six, and then the bosses afterwards. They're still in the castigators. Yeah, in fact, the boss has just got a volley gun, so it's the same thing, but he gets one extra shot. So, seven. Fours and fours. They've got two shots. Their yeah. pistols are two yeah. shots. They just, I, they nev I never really get to shoot them, so only nine inch from them. Wow. That's pretty good, isn't it? Uh, Is it rend? rend? No, no rend. Not that there's a problem, really. It's quite bad. Right, so these guys get a three up save. Helion sixes. Two sixes, oh no. So heal twice. And it's fell twice. Yeah. Oh. oh, yeah. So that was a, that was a one. Yeah. So yeah. You took two, saved, and repaired two. Yeah. Um, right. The engine master, who I need to remember every turn, can we roll a hit, save, or a wound? Yeah. Yep. So he might actually use it this turn for the first time. So which one is this guy? So this is the character here. Yeah. He's got a gun that's threes and twos. Right. He hits. Oh. He wins. Minus one. D3 damage. <gasps> so when 3 plus save goes to 4 plus. <laughs> <laughs> These guys. Are not Bead of sweat is dripping down Andy's face right now. <coughs> Three left. Four left. The other guys are an easier target. I should probably shoot them. <laughs> okay. Well, I've only got the yeah, ironclad left. Moved him a freaking inch forward last turn. <laughs> It'd be even better. Nightmare. Oh my god. I've got to do a lot of damage with this guy. He's definitely going to use yeah, his gold. <laughs> I'll just put the cannon onto these guys at the front. So the and how many of these are there? One, two, three, four. Four. There's four of each type now. Four crossbows, four bows. And you'll be mean plus shock anyway, so you've got two lots of these here. All right. I'll do the cannons into the castigators. Torpedoes and carbines into the other ones. Mm -hmm. Do the case. Do the case. Thank system. you. And I'm going to use my gold, so I'm going to reroll to hit against everything. But obviously, with some of them, I'm going to get reroll sixes. I know. Right. So the, oh. these are the cannon shots against the castigators. Yep. So I'm not rerolling six, sixes, no. but I am just rerolling. <laughs> <laughs> Good so times. Threes and threes. That's good, because that's two sixes in there. So they all hit. Yep. This is good. Threes to wound. Four wounds at minus one. Okay. That's two damage. Four up saves. <laughs> so again, I take... What is that? <laughs> in fact, I take one wound, but heal two. So I take that away. We've actually so got better actually off better. after that. Yeah. yeah, okay, so we've realised between it, it's a 7 plus that heals for the um, Stormcast. So whenever I had the Rend, you, you were saving seven. it on a 6, but you weren't healing. Yeah. So obviously you had that few extra wounds. Yeah, so um, we've, we've, we've applied three extra three wounds. came out. And then you've just taken two from yeah. the cannon, because the 6s weren't healing, they were just, just saves. Yeah. So, Cannon's done. So now I've just got all the shots against the other one dudes. One guy left. One guy left, but I've got no more shooting into him. Okay. And then these guys are the ones that have the um, reroll sixes. Re sixes, sixes to hit because they're holding within 12 inches. I'm rerolling anyway because I've used my gold. Yeah. So I'm basically rerolling everything except, well, whatever for the. So the, tor the torpedoes hit on fours. So a four or five stays a four or five. Anything else I have to reroll. 
Okay. Yeah. Well, there you go. The re-roll is Forces that, yeah. Misses. And three is to win. Okay. So two wounds at minus one D3 damage for a torpedo. Oh dear. Uh, Judicates have a save, they're not buffed by the. Um, so yeah, it's a four up. And then what's the end? One. Is it on two of them or three? There's two. One fail. Okay, sorry. No. D3 damage. Bum, ba, dum. Four. four. Four wins. Okay, so that's one, two, three, four. And then I've got the carbines, which are threes and threes. So I re-roll my misses, which is all of those, and I have to re-roll the, the six, six as well. The so two nice. hits out of all that so far. So, all right, six hits, three is to wound, four wounds, uh, minus one, two damage. Okay, five ups to save. And that's the end. Ah, oh, nearly. Oh <laughs> three wounds, six wounds, sorry. Six, six, six. wounds, so it's one, two, three. And gone. So, I have to make some charges to take that objective. <laughs> I've got a lot of a lot of options. Um, and I have a feeling the navigator gives reroll, reroll run and charge rolls with friendly sky vessels that are visible to a navigator. So the three boats can reroll their charges. Right. And I've got loads of command points. Okay. So someone's <laughs> got to get in. Gonna make it. Good, you deserve it after that round. No, right. So the uh, engine master. Ten. He's in. He's in. He just get. He gets to him. I don't know if I want to get to him or not. Let's just get to him. Probably fun. The Arconauts. Six. Ooh. Is that just enough? Yeah. Oh, good. It was a harsh, it was like a millimetre short or something. I don't know what else to. Uh, let's try the uh, Endrin Riggers. Oop. Seven. Seven. So, for whatever place, I don't think that's going to get anyone. No. I am going to charge him because he's going to be a massive roadblock potentially. Okay. So the front of his boat can get to here. <laughs> Just get in their way, basically. Um, I think it's, oh, I'll try and get charged both boats, why not? Yeah. So this boat, eight. Just because they can drop bombs at the start of the phase. <laughs> so. Get to it. Oh. oh, I don't know what that was on there. Is that the one that kept on getting end of spells? Did like six yeah. mortal wounds or something? I don't think it's really going to matter against a single six. castigator. And the frigate, <laughs> <coughs> three. You can reroll so you can see a navigator. Five. Uh, I don't think I can really land because I've got space with that roll, so I'll just leave that as it is. Okay. Right, that's quite a lot of charges, isn't it? Yeah. So at the start of the combat phase, I can drop my bombs. Yep. So on a four up, the uh, gun hauler will do it to him. Yep. Yep. Uh, D3, mortal wounds, oh, three mortal wounds. You can finish him off. And then- All castigators gone. No, no. The ironclad will do it to the other guy. Yes. Uh, he's on a two plus at the moment. D3 mortal wounds. Oh, three. Is that a Lord Relictor? It yeah. is. Okay, it's five wounds go down to two then. It's not going so well yeah. so far. And then I'm going to start the combat phase with the Engine Master. So he's got three attacks. Um, I've got the Artifact to reroll a one, which I'll probably use. Reroll one of them. Um, and any sixes do three mortal wounds on this attack. That's three mortal wounds. <laughs> oh, right. uh, so I don't so really he's use my effect. He's oh, gone. No. Um, and I guess the only thing, the only sort of pile-ins that are worth doing. So everyone, everyone who's charged can pile in, yeah. can't they? So um, pile into a griffhound. <laughs> is it worth tagging him? 
Probably not. This boat will pile in that way. So they will get to attack. So if you want to part if you you can pile them in up to three inches and then attack. Yeah. And I have to do, don't I? Yeah. You, the, the amount you pile in is up to three. Okay. But you might as well do as many attacks as you can. There's no real downside, I don't think. Yeah. Um, it would be two in, in my opinion. Uh, judicators. <clears throat> have one attack, threes and fours with no rend. To wind. There you go. The last one, these guys are just going to pull over this objective. So, that guy doesn't get to here, so they all can get in. Just swarm it. And that's. Oh, they have. Now they are in combat as well. So one guy is in, he's just got a um, gun butt. One attack, fours and fours. Um, but I think that's is my there, go. Is there any battle cool. to take? No, you rinse the unit actually. They're gone, haven't they? Yeah, it's the thing with the castigators, you're trying to force it, but you took one out. Right. So, end of battle round three, Andy. It's called three. Gets the objective in the middle. Yeah. That's right. Six three. Six three. So At the end of turn three. So, we're going into, yeah, battle round four. So, we need to see which is the objective. Okay. I haven't won one of these rolls yet. Point, the pointless roll off. Yeah. We got a five. Yay. Five. So, we must so get to one, two, roll a one or three, two. Four, five, six. Oh, I no. always roll ones and twos. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, so, uh, this is just oh. That's my job. Right. So, uh, who won the roll off? Ross we haven't done it yet. No. Uh, oh, sorry. So, yeah, so Ross need, you need to um, do oh, the yeah, spider bravery yeah. thing. Okay, so you got bravery of seven. Two D6, isn't it? Yeah. Was it holding within nine? Yeah. I think that's right. Yeah, he's fine. <laughs> Nobody's taken any spider damage, right? Priority roll. Uh, you win draws this time, don't yeah. you? Cool. I get a six. 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 Three. You choose. Um, it's the best way to play it. When when the, the points are taken at the end of the battle round for yeah. this, aren't they? Um, I might as well take the turn to get into position, which will be something like this. Yeah. <laughs> so you do. Just buff them up as best you can. Yeah. <laughs> so, start off battle round four, Andy's just chucked <laughs> the swords off the, off the battlefield. I didn't get hit by them, so that's pretty good. Yeah. Uh, the only thing I can do, I can't use my command ability thing because no one's holding within nine inches of this guy. Uh, so, I'm just going to cast his uh, Warden Lantern over these guys that are wholly within, and it's going to add plus one to their saves. Uh, and now I'm going to move, which isn't going to take me long. I'm basically just going to hide on that objective. Yeah. Right, this so sounds Ross, fun. Ross has moved his um, uh, sequitors in this last bastion kind of standoff area. Yeah. Um, left the griff out there. Lord Castello has come back to lead from the front. And the griff has <laughs> moved there for whatever reason. We'll find out in a Devastating minute. reasons is why. <laughs> right, for a bit of shooting phase, I'm going to fire with the judicators into yeah. this bait, see if I can finish one thing I started. Yeah. I'll grab a green dice, please. It can be the. I hope we've got the win right with the six wounds you've taken. I've no idea. Oops. Oh. So it was three pluses to hit, so I hit with everything. The green one was the prime, which explodes into d6 hits. So I get another. And then there are three pluses to wound. With minus one rend. That's three saves. Five up save. Three takes three wounds. Up to nine. Uh, and then the other thing I'll do in my huge turn is try and charge with the griff. <laughs> Yay! So if you go 11, that could be really annoying. Are you going to 
Who's he going to annoy? <laughs> right, this guy's probably going to smash him up. Yeah, it's not going to go well. <laughs> so if I charge boats there, you can just come up and pick them up and put them back here, can't you? So mm -hmm. that doesn't gum anyone down. These guys are already in combat. I can't whiz through a gap and bog these guys down reasonably. Uh, you've got to finish within, as long as you're in three inches of them, they're fault. Well, they can still retreat, to be fair. I think Plus, I'll you've got the thing that the boats can do the bombs. Yeah. <clears throat> Whatever. If, if you're in a ring like that, I don't think it's your planning longevity, are you? I'm going to charge into this guy. Hope I survive something long so, enough to be a pain. At the end of the charge phase, if if you end within three inches of the ironclad, the yep. ironclad gets to shoot his cannon. Okay, go for it. <laughs> <laughs> I've not used the griff hand before, so it's just it's just fun. Should we go for the six just damage better. one? Just yeah. But it's <laughs> more fun. So it's threes and twos. No rerolls. Right oh, now. I don't have a save. <laughs> <laughs> Two up to do six mortal wound. Six damage. Sorry, not. Six. No! <laughs> Heroic. You got hit by it as well. How's your mockery going now, with the Griff Hound? I mean, I've still got more. I've still oh, now. <laughs> at the start of the combat phase, I get to drop my bombs. As long as he's within an inch, which is within an inch of both boats. So him on a four up does D three mortal wounds. Uh huh. Yep. Does three. Okay, but he's got and three wounds. So should we just finish oh. this? Up? <laughs> How did he survive? It? He got away. hit by a cannon, but somehow survived it. Uh, right, so to start some combat, I'm going to fight with these three Judicators against this boat. Um, they have one attack each, and it is threes and fours with their gladiuses. So I pick up another die. Oh, that was a three. Dynamic way of doing it, though, wasn't it? And force to wound. One wound. Is this his no, last wound? No it wound. Is. He oh, died. Oh, he well done. Chipped it away. Yeah, basically. Oh, he has to do our gold. It's stuck oh. up, the, up the exhaust. Yeah. I think that's, <clears throat> yeah, that's, that's, yeah, they can get hit back <laughs> and deserve it after that, but that's all that's I can do. just them. Yeah. So he's can come back with him, so you just come that around the other side. So, what have they got? Gumbats. And one of them, the boss, has also got a drill bill. Which is so the drill bill that the boss has got. Actually a three inch range. D three is hit shots or combat attacks. Fours and fours. One hit. One wing with the drill bill. Minus one, one damage. Okay, so four up save goes to a five, which I fail. So I take a wound. And then They've all got um, gumbats as well, so fours and fours. One Four. more, but no rain this time. Four plus, failed, removes one. Enforces battle shock. Uh, right, mm. battle shock for me. Yeah. Mm. Lost one. Lost one. I got a bravery of seven. Oh, you find this. Um, something that we spoke about, but I don't know if it's on film, is that in the combat phase, I said that the secretaries are also going to empower their shields for this round. Yeah. Meaning that they can re-roll saves. Normally, we just get um, re-rolls of one, but they can re-roll all failed saves, which might come in handy. Uh, that's it. Right. I'm surprised it took that long, <laughs> yeah. to be honest. Right, so we've... Uh very quick movement, just the two boats really moved and uh, these guys came up and that was it, wasn't it? That's it, yeah. yeah. How much can I kill? Yeah. So, shooting phase, um, the battalion, which is now just him, oh, and the Thunderers, yeah. uh, you're going to reroll ones against this unit secretaries. Yep. And um, I'm going to start shooting. Okay. Uh, I'll, I'll just do this bit, just to kill them off, basically. So when the uh, Thunder is in combat, add one to the characteristics of missile weapons when they're in three of an enemy model. <laughs> <Right>. um, <laughs> boss has the double-barreled rifles, now got five shots, threes and fours. Two wounds and minus one. 
Okay, so four up safe goes to fives. Ah, oh, there's one out straight away. That's nice one. The Fumigator has three attacks. Now four attacks. Threes and fours. So yeah, no threes and threes. Sorry. One wound minus one one damage. Okay, four up safe goes to a five. One damage, you say? Yeah. Okay. And then one the next left. three weapons all get plus one to hit now because of the other special rule. So Deck Sweeper's now got five attacks, threes and fours. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, one wound, minus one, one damage. Five up. Oh. Ooh. They're not doing the save. I oh, know, it's rend anyway. Uh, the cannon. Two shots now. Threes and twos. Minus two D3 damage. This is the best gun. Okay, so four up save goes to a six. D3, yeah, 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 one wind anyway. Good. Nicely done, nicely done, all cleared. So shooting things. Right, everything else <laughs> is shooting at them. Okay. I mean, they're the only thing left actually. So, yeah. uh, so navigator. Makes sense. Threes and threes. Which one's the navigator? That's drunk. Re-roll re re sixes. Oh. Yeah. You got one six. Thank you. Fine. Yeah. <laughs> Still got one That's six. Reason. One wound at minus one, one damage. Okay, so they have got a save of four, which is going to a three because of their cast event. Four. So manage it. Is that minus one rend? Just minus one, yeah. Sorry, you so can't save, save that. Me. That's yeah. right. So these guys, the only person in range is the grapple launcher. Fours and threes. Missed. The engine master has got one attack. Threes and twos. Yep. Yeah. Threes. Minus two D3 damage. Okay. Sorry, so no, minus, yeah, minus one D3 damage, sorry. Ah, so that's a four up. Nope. Two uh, damage. I can, no, I can't. Sorry. Carry on. Two damage. Two damage, so I'll take mm -hmm. one away. So these guys, we had one pistol in range, and we choose fours and fours. Reroll the sixes. Yeah. Uh, one wound, no rent. Okay, so it's a three up save. The volley gun's in range. Yeah. She has fives and fours. Two hits. <laughs> no wounds. And then he's got one um, skyhook in there, it's fours and threes. Missed. Oh. Oh dear, killed one so far. Yeah. <coughs> We've got the two boats to do. I was going to say, they're pretty These good. These are the best though, bit, yeah. I'm sorry. Let's do the ironclad first then. He's rerunning ones because he's part of the battalion. So, the shrapnel cannon, threes and threes. No ones, but no sixes either. Wow. Four at minus one. Okay. These are four plus saves. Two damage each. So does six damage. Six damage. So I'll take one, two, three. Oh. Fine. Uh, the carbines. Oh, you guys, you look after me. Okay. Torpedo, sorry. Fours and threes. <laughs> Rerolling ones. Oh. Just one. Wow. Minus one D3 damage. Okay, so it's a four plus save. Naturally, I get the one. But you can reroll ones, can't you? Only in the combat phase with the shields. Ah. We agreed. Okay. Yeah, sorry, I just rolled the four. Oh, there. it's another one. <clears throat> and then his last shots. <laughs> I pick up a handful of dice. Uh, threes and threes with his carbines. Rerolling sixes. And ones. Yeah, and there's <laughs> another six in there. There we go. And two just misses. Okay. And threes again. <clears throat> so four at minus one, two damage. Okay. Four's two so damage. Oh dear. Oh, nice. gross. Stink roll. What is that? Um, so four are going, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I'll go one, two, three, four. You've still got the objective, eh? And the last shooting. Oh, he's still in twelve. 
Yes. So the D6 cannon shots. Six, just what you need. Time, yeah. Yeah, no, actually, it's really good. Oh. Threes and threes. Oh, I'm going to use his one bit of gold he's still got. We're all hits. Makes sense. Mm -hmm. So, two misses to re-roll and a six to re-roll. Four hits, threes to wound. Two wounds at minus one, two damage. Okay. Your roll, that's going to be... <laughs> Four pluses to save. Oh, there we nice. go. And then the last shooting attack are the carbines. Threes and threes. Oh. Every roll, all those. Okay. Nicely done. Even nicer. Minus one, two damage. Oh dear. Four pluses to save. Two Let's more die. Two more die. <clears throat> Oh, I wish you didn't have that command point. <laughs> yeah. Good job uh, you very wisely saved it. I couldn't do anything to kill all my heroes. <laughs> so, all I've got the auto run the griff. is charging. Yeah. I've got two, three command points to start my phase. Yeah. So, it can be a lot of reroll charges if anything misses. Although the boats can reroll anyway. So, that boat over there. This one here. Yep. He's going to charge. I don't even know if he's in range, but we'll... 11. An 11. Four. He is in range. Yep. So these can come in. Sort of here. That's right. <laughs> <I can't laughs> he's only one model, though. <laughs> the frigate... Uh, sorry, the ironclad. Seven. Okay. Enough to get him in range of the... The first bit around here. The Endrin Master. Nine. Nine. So he could come around to this side, couldn't he? Oh. <laughs> that counts. <laughs> Dead. Ten more for wins. <laughs> <laughs> and then the Arknauts, which is potentially pretty important. Ten. Although you will just kill them pretty badly. So the back one is still going to get in combat. So. Gold for the combat phase. <laughs> um, okay, so that's all the charges I can do. The boats can both drop the bombs at the start of the combat phase. Uh, he's getting plus one. So this guy on a two up will do D3 more so A one. Oh. And the frigate on a three up does D3 mortal wounds. One. One mortal wound from the bombs. Okay. Uh, I will start with my engine master. He's probably the best. Uh, so the engine master, threes. Do I have three or sixes for this as well? Just shooting, isn't it? Um, at the start of the combat phase, if I can declare it, I, I'll, I'll re be able to re-roll my saves. But no, it's only missile attacks that you re-roll the sixes on. So he so hits on threes, on sixes are more, those are mortal wounds. Oh, it does, there is a six. And I'm going to use his artifact that I've never, I've not used all game, but yeah. I get to do it every turn, to re-roll one of his hit rolls. Okay. So another hit. So that's just three mortal wounds. Yeah. I don't think it's an addition. Yeah, okay. that's that's just the end. So three more to wound there, and then twos to wound. We take these guys. So two wounds at minus one. <laughs> you get what, four up rerollable, three up rerollable, four up rerollable. Yeah. Luckily, this is two twos. Classic. Even worse. Oh. So D what's that? Another two. D three. Yeah. Five. Wow. Five. Okay. Wow. This is the game, isn't it? Yeah. I and honestly thought one's, you were going to win this game. Got one. Andrew Master is pretty tasty when he goes off. Uh, that's him done. But um, I'll fight with the Lord Castellan, I guess, against these guys. Um, he's got three attacks, threes and threes. Sorry. 
two hit. One attacks, uh, sorry, one wounds. Uh, it's minus one red and two damage. <laughs> Save <it. laughs> Um. Against these guys. They'll use their gold to reroll hits. Oh, they're going to have to split their attacks, aren't they? They got two gun butts and two regular dudes on him, and then the rest will be there because they're going to. they will get in, in don't they? Think about it. So two gun butts and three regular dudes on him, and then the rest, the other four on him, five on him. So the gun butts, fives. Fours and fives, sorry. Yeah, fours and fives. One, oh, re rolling, so use my one triumph. Yeah. No wins. And then three regular dudes, just fours and fours. So two hit. One wound on the wounded Castigo. It's got a re-rollable three-up save. Cool. I already thought you were going to do a Ross thing. <laughs> do a Ross. I will, I will. I There's still time. <laughs> so I've got three normal dudes on your boss. <coughs> Fours. Fours. <laughs> The boss, who actually I could have just done the same time, because he's not any better in combat. Not a city. Fours. Reroll him. Missed. Uh -oh. And then the last one is a Sky Park. It's two attacks, fours and fours. One hit. Fails to win. Right. They, they weren't into it. Uh, you've got your boss, dude. Uh, he's yeah. fought, so I guess yeah, you've got one, one attack with this guy. So it's three attacks, please, with the Sorry. swords. Hogging all the dice. I know you are. Um, it's three, three plus to hit, <coughs> four plus to wound, with no rend. So two wounds. Four up save. Huh. Uh, he's got, both got three inch piling and a one inch range gun. So um, close combat. Weapon, so he's going to get him. Um, so it's boarding weapons, he's still got eight of them, so fours and fours. Uh, no rerolls because I nominated the other two. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> Nothing? Oh, good. Uh, and then he can pile in. Yeah. And he'll attack the wounded guy, I guess. More likely to do something. I wouldn't count it, so I don't know. He has got six boarding weapons, but again, fours and fours. Yeah. Nice. Okay, four wounds on the. What's there any? <coughs> no. So they've got a three up. Three up, re rolling. Re rolling. Oh, look at this. So there's no rend, so that heals the wound. Okay. Does it? Yeah. Because he's Is down that... to one? Yeah, yeah, of course. Yeah, there's no rend. Yeah. So he's now up to two wounds. So he's now up to two. He's on our lives. He's taken one. Yeah? Yeah. So he just takes one. <clears throat> oh, my voice is getting steadily worse. <laughs> 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 it's the Too excitement. excitement. Um, that's all that's the combat it. phase. So I take the objective at the end of turn four? Yeah. Six or... Six all, yeah. Six all, yeah. Six all yeah. Oh, nicely done, mate. Yeah, because you're not gonna. <laughs> yeah, turn five. Not, I'm not doing anything for turn five. That's it. That's it. I've got well, all three objectives. Well, there we have it. An exciting finale. I don't know how you guys felt, but that was very tense. Yeah, all yeah. The way right through. to the end. I was convinced I was lost. Yeah. Repeatedly. Uh, <laughs> I honestly thought Ross had it after turn two, but... Uh, no, it was no, fine. I, it I think well. it was very well deserved. Yeah, mine were just in kind of the right place, kind of the wrong place. My <laughs> sequitur drop was dumb, I think. It wasn't the right place. It ended up being in the right place by the end, but not through any kind of uh, insight. Yeah. And Sutterly's heroes so early on as well. I did not think that you would suddenly be like, yeah, like there straight away. I positioned to survey the three points, go for two maybe. So yeah, I didn't expect that at all. Got me right on the bat for There's nothing you can do to protect your heroes yeah. apart from putting them near squads, get yeah. minus one. Yeah. But I have so many re rolls, they just 
if that's had a chance. But yeah. It's crazy, isn't it? But it was, you played the objectives and like you nearly... This time. If yeah. I hadn't killed all of them on that middle objective, yeah. you'd have won. Yeah. And then if I hadn't killed all the secretaries on that turn, you'd have yeah. won. Maybe Secretus in the middle, buff with the Relictor and the yeah. Castellet would have split your forces more and would have held that more if I'd have um, thought about that better. Um, but I didn't. So. You, did roll, you did roll really badly. <laughs> Their save rolls were atrocious. Yeah. yeah. How you rolled so badly on like a three up re-rollable save? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. It's a skill. So. Yeah. <laughs> Not a good one. <laughs> That's it. Well, thanks for that. Uh, remember to head over to minimagtray.co.uk and pick up some uh, trays. And I think that's it. Next time, uh, we are going to be uh, leaping through this to get a few more uh, ideas. We've all started Thousand Point Armies, uh, so we've got more armies coming along on the channel. Got yeah. So, Nesh, you picked up some. Yeah, I'm going to start some Maggot Kinner. Yeah, and yeah. I have nearly threw a thousand points of Iron Jaws, but um, yeah, we can uh, use this to do a, a mixed chaos army and Nick's got some more tribes and also from this we're now going to have running bloodthirsters yeah running and charging mm. so uh, look out for that <laughs> Great. I'm looking forward to that <laughs> <laughs> but yeah well thanks for watching um, yeah and uh, we will see you guys on the next one cheers see ya bye, bye.